and I'm doing it for my daughter. Warren Beatty's house. <laughs> Warren Beatty. Warren Beatty was the other tunnel. The oh, one with James Conn, Warren Beatty. Nasty yeah. dude, that guy is. Warren yeah, Warren Beatty. Beatty's weird. That is sick. What's wrong with Warren Beatty? He's, he stayed out of the eye. You look You look at Warren, Warren well, he's Jewish too. Is he? That's, yeah, that's probably. The parallax view is one of the best of all time. <clears throat> if you've never seen that, then we should all die. He's 86? Holy shit. He's one in 30. Warren Beatty's fucking old. He's not dead yet. See Parallax View, you'll die. Really? Is that good? I told you when I watched Parallax View, right? What was the... I don't even know if we should talk about that. Oh, was it crazy? Oh, man. Was it some sort of a gang? I tell you that. It was a, it was a story. It was like a synchronicity thing. Do you remember, who, do you remember the guy that was assassinated in it? It's Charles Carroll. No shit. Yeah. Do you remember when I told you I watched that? I don't remember that It memory. was the night... The last night that we ever talked. Really? I went home and for no reason at all. I didn't. I didn't even know what it was, Charles. What? I put. I did. Did I? Did I didn't tell you this? No. I think I texted it to you, and I, I never got a text back. God. For eight years or I, ten years. I or think whatever. I was. I think I was the parallax. The last you. time I talked to you, I went home, and for no reason, I didn't know what it was. I'd never heard of it. Parallax view. I just have a bunch of torrented movies on my computer. Hmm. And I just opened up Parallax view. I had no idea what it was. First eight minutes or whatever, it says, we're here at the inquest of the assassination of Senator Charles Carroll. <laughs> it's so good. What, how is that possible? Isn't that the most insane thing you've ever heard? That's unnerving. That is. That's you told me that. I, I that is pretty that weird. Stuff. That's fucking crazy. You look, up, you look outside the window after that. I'm not making up any of those details either. I never heard of it. Had no idea what the fuck it was. Just saw the title. How is that possible? It's but a good, Warren Beatty good is art. Jewish and a creep. Good art on the. Yeah, he dated Madonna. That's all you need to know. He's a fucking creep. The fight scenes yeah. were good. In he's the type. Of, he Warren Beatty's the type of guy where you look at him and it's like, um, you know, you look you look at uh, Leonardo DiCaprio and like he's part of the posse. He's you know, like, like a big man, man he baby. Must, he must have been getting pussy back in the day. And you don't have to like obsess over it or think or fantasize about it. But it's like, yeah, you know, it would have been good to be an actor and getting all that pussy, being the pussy posse. Yeah, getting laid. Yeah, Leonardo DiCaprio he had a fun time. They you look at Warren Beatty. You think this? You think the same thing? And but there's the element of like um, uh, Pia's dad where he's washing the dog's <laughs> off in the sink. <laughs> so Warren Beatty's go, Warren Beatty goes goes and gets pussy and then washes his hands obsessively for thirty minutes afterwards. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. And it's like it's just this is nasty. nasty. Yeah, he's he, one of the guys like Wilt Chamberlain. He's like I slept with uh, nasty my fuck. body count. It's like. Twenty five thousand. Yeah, <laughs> he's yeah, like yeah. one of those like guys. So, sociopathic yeah. body count. You like you have to like you you do the math on it. You realize what the the work it took to yeah. like. What are you going to get skin grafts on your dick after you rub it out? That's oh, what I'm freaking, saying. There's a jellyfish underneath, and you pull out. <laughs> Fucking nasty creep. What? Tell me more about what you know about being shamed in public for shitting on Sarah Jessica Parker. That's like fascinating to me. Hmm. I just I've heard that uh, <laughs> as a, <laughs> as a stand up tale, like a tale of stand ups in New York, is that if you have really? Sarah Jessica Parker in your routine, the audience will turn on you. But I have no, I don't know if that's. Can you imagine? I, you know, I bet it though, because yeah. you lose half the women. You do like the women would hate you. Yeah, like I, I've said before to like Jess, I'm like, like I'm like, Sex in the City. Any girl that I ever had sex with that liked Sex in the City was like a fucking loser. Mm -hmm. Like no cool girl would be like, oh yeah, that girl was so cool, you should have stayed with her. That girl was like mm -hmm. a fucking office dork, mm -hmm. like yeah. a loser. She like, was good. She got enemas before our first date. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> And I would like, I seriously, that's like a. I wonder if Lena Dunham tried to shoot for that. Yeah, she did. She was like, I want to be, yeah, I want to have the Iron Man reputation. Well, they started getting Modern. girls that were below the standard people had become accustomed to, and then they started to normalize that. Yeah, like and Seth Rogen. Everybody, every now everybody's in a big pig slam. Mm -hmm. I gotcha. Pebbles, her, Miss Pebbles. Thank you very much. What a sex tip Stupid that is. Stupid bitch. What a sex tip that is. I think the Adam character in this is supposed to be based on me and Brian. <laughs> I would bet. Yeah. I think that's actually true. The Adam Driver? Adam, whatever Adam Driver's character is in this. Should yeah. I, so that's an insane thing to say, but I think, <laughs> I think, that's, a th I think that's actually true. It was well, you and Brian in your glory days? I think, I think Brian fucked one of the girls and I fucked one of the girls. Oh. So, I think that's... I think that's yeah. yeah. Oh. And I remember she called, uh, Lena called me before she was famous and she was, she, she was like, Sam, please don't fuck one of my actresses. She said that? Yeah, yeah. Don't fuck one of my actresses? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I wonder if... I the, need her in the city, Sam. Please, I need her. I wonder if uh, the actresses would like to know that they were referred <laughs> to her? as one what of her Lena? actresses. Shit, they probably, probably know what the deal is. Yeah, they probably do. They're probably so busy getting fucked. <clears throat> Stupid fuckers. Shit. Liam Dunham's hot. <laughs> <laughs> I'm 
Hot take. Lena Dunham is hot. The best. <laughs> <laughs> She's like Dr. Drew to me. Her sex tips are what I live by. Is, <laughs> is she Jewish? Um, no. I'm not sure you have to ask that. I don't, e I don't even hate Lena Dunham that much. I think she, she's I'm hot. sure she's been in some good stuff. I don't, I don't know if I've ever seen her. Her thing is, she's just the the logical conclusion of all the New York. She's <clears> like <throat> a symptom. She's like a symptom. She is Jewish, yeah. She's but hot. She's not, she's not a playmaker. She's just a symptom, so gives a shit, really. I heard she like uh, keeps her real clean and loves to do fake and gives without asking for it. Mm -hmm. And she after and I heard after she's done giving she makes you your favorite meal no matter what it costs. That's true. I heard all that. And that's I heard she's a big uh, motorsports enthusiast. Yeah. Uninvited head, though. That's enough to piss you off on the No, 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 day. no, no. If, if, just if you want it, you can just like oh. tap the table. And if you like wanted a job in a weird spot, just you just pat go, her on the back. Yeah, and she's like, yeah. oh, no problem. And then she gives you a full... Uh, a special handshake. However yeah. long job you want. And then right after you're done, she'll make you, she'll make you like pro-level sushi or whatever you want it to eat. She'll yeah. cook it for you. She Light can't be all that bad. No, no. It's, and then she wants. She'll be like. And then she just leaves and makes sure that you're all set. She covers you the blanket, and then make sure you have your Xbox controller in your hand, and then leaves. Whoa. She gives you an ice pack or a heat blanket, whatever you well, want. Why weren't there any episodes like that? There, there were. were yeah, she oh. made another series called uh, "Taking Care of called Taking guys. Care of the Guys." <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yo. <laughs> she makes you like croissant ham and cheese with nice Swiss cheese and taking nice care sauce. of the guys. <laughs> taking care of the men <laughs> by Lena Dunham. Oh yeah. yeah. Clean yeah. my pipes. The new show. Yep. yep. <laughs> she'll ask you mid what? if you want a, a nice rim or an alcohol swab to clean up your butt just for fun Whoa. and then she'll get you some fresh fruit cut a nice glass of water with ice in it mm -hmm. and a sandwich yeah with cucumbers and then a nice toasted sandwich does she have a George Foreman? yep and she says at any point if you're feeling horny again because I know you're hungover and you tend to get a little more horny when you're hungover <laughs> she's like you can do whatever you want to <laughs> anytime anywhere any place for whatever reason for Clams how long Casino. Horny. Chris yep. can we see Lena Dunham that's the Clams Casino. No. And then she's going to order you a, a cold water PEI oysters. Uh, lucky line, just like you like. You, you have to yeah, replenish your zinc. And your bobos. Yeah. <laughs> if you want her to get... To, uh, go to images there. If you want her to get to you faster, she'll put uh, wheels on her elbows and knees. And <laughs> <laughs> Elbow pads. Let's manage the setting. <laughs> Holy shit. And let's turn it off. She's cool as fuck. She's Zoftig, as they would say. I heard if you... um she She'll Who's exclusively they? date you. And you can... You can <laughs> She can, she'll include an app uh, on your phone that you just hit a button on it and she'll come to you on wheels with no face. It's like a custom Uber job. Chris, yep. can we see some pictures big? Oh, yeah. oh, that's a nice one right there. Just in that window there, we can see some more pictures. She can plop on down, mm -hmm. plopping around. She's like, do you want me to put on some um, some of your music some that weight. you like? Some weight. <laughs> some weight that you like? She's putting plates on for you. <laughs> I'm going to put some me on your head. Well, that's the reason why she blew up so big is because she her uh, her husband likes them big. <clears throat> yeah, big, big, and the, her husband wanted her to gain a hundred pounds. Apparently, so she she was like, "I'll be yeah your soldier. I'll be your true. I'll do it for you. I want you to have more flesh so you can fit more perfect in there." Yeah, <laughs> and that's what she did. She's really just she'd be in your house making you baked goods right now and making sure that your mm -hmm. computer doesn't have any viruses or anything, mm -hmm. and then just making you cool iced coffee drinks. Was she known for being mean or anything, or was she just nope. chill and just talking politics lightly? Like, was she was she like one of the rabid ones, or no? I don't think so. I don't. I don't, I don't, re I don't remember. I just remember her stuff being around. I don't I remember her opening. Molested you know. her sister, but oh yeah, <clears throat> that I do. That I know so well. It felt like I was there. Yeah, she was trying. She loved MDE World Peace too so much. She said she was trying to buy me a cool car at Meekum. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, she's like, you like like German cars? I was like, yeah. Why? She's like. Yeah, there's there's a pretty couple of cool early 3.0 CSs. I know you like the E9 chassis. Do you want one? There's one in Malaga. I'm like, I don't like Malaga. That's like maroon, right? She's like, yeah, I don't want Malaga. She's like, I have one in, uh, and I have Granatrot. I'm like, Granatrot's like the same color. She's like, how about a uh, bronze it beige metallic? I was like, yeah, but does it have the like, gold wheels on it? She's like, it does. It has BBS spacers on it. They're really nice deep dish. I'm going to get you this, and then I'll come home and it to completion. Three to four times. Chicago didn't she, car didn't ride. She get us Rolexes. Yeah, she got you the one you the 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 thirty the custom thirty eight millimeter. Damn. Yeah, presidential she's jubilee fluted. She's a good girl. Well, when I get a watch, it's going right over the sleeve. It's yeah. gotta. It's gotta. Like you know, a watch I've seen that I think is a I think would look good on Charles. <clears throat> What's that? The Tag Monaco. What is Let's it? Take a look. It's the square. I, I've been one. meaning to ask about the other accoutrements that I should be desirous of. I think it's a piece of shit, oh. uh, but it's it does look it does have it a does Charles have a good look, look to it. Yeah, it does. Oh, damn. like that's a Charles. You know those jackets like you wear. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, got yeah. the racing stripes. Yeah, 
The Euro. What's that? Uh, I the like that. Euro GT. Tag Monaco. Oh, Steve McQueen used to wear oh, that's those? That's a big Steve one. Steve McQueen. Oh, it is big boy. Tag Monaco. Maybe it's not bad if Steve McQueen was wearing it. 